Hello friends, imagine a weapon system that can not only shoot down enemy missiles but also target satellites in space. Sounds like something from a sci-fi movie, right? But this is exactly what China might have developed. Recently, images surfaced showing what experts believe to be China's brand new HQ-29 missile defense system. So what is it, why is it important, and how will it change the balance of power? Let's break it down. Pictures started circulating showing a huge six-axle transporter carrying two massive missile canisters, each almost one and a half meters in diameter, much larger than China's earlier systems. According to sources, it's been called a double-barreled satellite hunter, intercepting both missiles and satellites in low Earth orbit. China already operates the HQ-9 for air defense and HQ-19 for high-altitude interception. The HQ-29 fills the missing layer, mid-course interception in space during flight. This makes it comparable to America's SM-3 or Russia's S-500, giving China a complete defense shield. The missile uses advanced control thrusters, mini solid rockets that allow tiny adjustments in space. This hit-to-kill approach is extremely precise, directly colliding with high-speed targets. China has been developing this technology since the early 2000s. This might be close to deployment. If functional, China could intercept enemy missiles and potentially blind opponents by targeting their satellites. In today's world, space is as important as land, sea, or air. Losing satellites means losing eyes and ears. This will alarm the United States, India, and Japan, shifting the balance in the Indo-Pacific region. The HQ-29 represents China's ambition to dominate the next frontier of warfare, space. This system could change how future wars are fought, where satellites are as vulnerable as aircraft. Are we entering a new space arms race? And who will come out on top? That's something the whole world will be watching.